year selling peanuts at Ascot, right, Dana? Right. And uh, Dana says that um, he throws the trick shots just like uh, Mr. Owens here, and we're going to test Dana and we're going to test Roger. And I think one of the folks we're going to test him against is Mr. Tommy White because I was telling him all about uh, Roger, and he doesn't believe it. Mr. Roger Owens here, the peanut man, has been clocked at 93 miles an hour with a bag of peanuts. And uh, we're going to see if Tommy would like to try to catch one of them. Now, who's Tommy? Now, who? Tommy White? Yeah, I thought everybody knew Tommy White. Tommy White is our new point leader. And... Uh, second end points over here doing the trick shots with no peanuts is Mr. Sleepy Trip. Throw a bag to Sleepy here. <laughs> I, think he, I think he's in a shell game. He, he dropped that on purpose, make me look bad. Uh, he tries to make everybody look bad. Here's Tommy right there. See if you can't uh, throw a bag to Tommy. Well, Tommy, I think you better step back. You right. might get hurt. Has, has he got any money in him? You know, we got to have a little, a little money there. Oh, oh, Tommy, Tommy, Tommy. Oh. That's better, that's better. Two bucks, you, I want to check in the mail tonight. Two bucks. <laughs> oh, they're coming back already. <laughs> uh, Dana, uh, see if you can't hit Tommy. Get, give it a try. Be behind your back. Go ahead, Dana. All right, well, a little slow, a little slow. I'll tell you what, Dana, uh, you've got to watch out, and you can't do this without properly warming up. You know what I mean? You can get, develop peanut elbow. It'll ruin your career here at Ascot. You've got to watch the rotator cuff, too. That can get bad. But we've got to go for a double shot. we got to, the two, of, the two of you right here, right? So you got to put the helmet down for just a second. All right. And stand, stand next to each other. Because we, we go one, two at a time, right? Oh. All right. you got to try that one. you got to try that one, Dan. You, you, you need another bag of peanuts. Here, here. You gotta, we go, we're going two at a time now, behind the back. Get up, get up a little closer. All right. Hey, that's good. That, that's a good try. That's good. I like that. Uh, how far could you throw a bag of peanuts? I don't know. I have never actually been measured in rows how far that I can throw a bag. At Dodger Stadium, the longest throw I ever made was not with a bag of peanuts. It was with a baseball. In 1976, the Dodgers gave me the honor of opening up the 76 season by throwing a baseball from the peanut box on the second deck all the way to Steve, Steve Yeager at home plate. Uh, that's fine. Yeah, that's, that's quite an honor. Um, you just uh, got um, done playing last night. Night, thrown last night. Where was that? I was at the Express game last night. Uh, there wasn't, I don't think there were any more people at the Express game than there are right here tonight. I think we had about the same size crowd. Only this is a much nicer crowd. This is a much nicer crowd. I've already said hello to a lot of my fans up there, and uh, my trip, the previous football game that I had worked at right before these uh, Express season started, I didn't see me and these people there. I was in Tokyo, Japan at the Japan Bowl in Yokohama Stadium. I'd like to see a few of these people from Gardena come out there next year. I mean, I've been invited back. Uh, do they have uh, room for a few midgets? Midget cars? Midget cars. Uh, yeah, but the track, it's its a bed of ice. I mean, rice. <laughs> ice and rice in January, right. <laughs> but the executive vice president here who really does a terrific job. We're going to have to get away from the speaker here, Roger. <laughs> What we're going to do is let Ben get up in the press box, and Roger's going to throw one right through the window. Okay, we're going to pick some folks out at random. How about my uh, brother-in-law right over there? Watch him do his stuff as he runs up and down the aisle. He never gets in the press box. Oh, we've got the fast nut, the curve nut, the knucklebag. Show us a new one.
Okay, Ben's up there in the press box. How about shooting one right through the window, Roger? Don't throw him a curve now. Behind the back, through the window. Got it. Let's try another. Uh, Roger, uh, Ted, and uh, the folks up there are awful hungry. Some arm trouble, he says. 